LHS. We're the hosts, Kiara and Ziana. Is this really our first episode of Marketing Period 4? Yeah, girl, I know. If you want to take advantage of the new marketing period, there's tutoring opportunities available at the high school. Tutoring is available in all teachers are from 2 to 5 to 15 every day after school. It's a place to be if you want to get help or do work, but not for socializing. If you are looking to hang out with other students and support your school at the same time, you should consider coming out to support our athletes as they compete. There are tons of opportunities to support your seniors as they play home this week. Tonight, come out and support your boys basketball team as they take on Cedar Crest. On Tuesday, your superstar girls basketball team is back at it again with Cocal Girls High School. On Wednesday, come out and see the boys wrestling team take off Cedar Crest High School in our gym. Finally, next Thursday is another night of basketball. Come check out your girls as they play against Penn Manor for their senior night. Back to you! We'll be looking for you at the games. Don't forget to hit up the concession stand while you're here too. And speaking of the concession stand, don't forget to take a look at the post next stage that has been making about employment opportunities. The most recent one is including an opportunity for students interested in a restaurant or hospitality business and an opportunity for students that can drive. Next, a second with Gabe for a round of Would You Rather. I go. So, would you rather be depressed but really rich, or mm. be happy but not really rich? You know I'd mean? rather be depressed and be yeah. really rich. I'm not even gonna be depressed no more. Like, come on, bro. And what you eating, Rand? Dominican nuts. Oh. <laughs> Broke and happy yeah. or rich and depressed? I would definitely rather be uh, broke and happy. Uh, right. Money is nothing if, if you can't find happiness, right? Yeah. What's, what's money if, I, if I'm miserable? I don't care. I could have zero dollars or a billion dollars. If I'm miserable, it's all the same. Yeah, I'd rather be depressed and rich, bro. Depressed and really rich? I could get the best medication, the best therapist. I wouldn't even be depressed really get that line. I'd rather be depressed but really rich because money buys happiness. Rich and depressed because I can buy whatever I want. So I'd rather be. Rich and sad. Yeah, I'd rather be rich and sad. Bro. I'd rather be rich and sad. <laughs> like, happy, happy and broke is crazy. Yeah, yeah. What, what you happy about? What I'm happy about if I'm broke? <laughs> what you happy about? Uh, I don't got no much money. What you doing? Thanks. Nothing in my pocket. Right, bro, there's no happiness without bread, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Bro, bro if they say money don't buy happiness, happiness. they lie. Happiness, they they lie. Yeah. Always choose happiness. Money doesn't buy happiness. Be happy with what you have and you'll live a happy life. Well, hands down, I'd rather be happy because you can't buy happiness. They say money can't buy happiness, but it can buy a jet ski, and I've never seen someone frown at one of those. Obviously, you need uh, some money to fulfill your basic needs of food, clothing, and shelter, but happiness is way more important than wealth. Especially, I can tell you somebody that's a cancer survivor and, and has had a lot of loved ones pass away being, you know, kind of a younger person in my family. Uh, faith and family and, and your health, that's, that's what it's all about. I'd rather be uh, rich and depressed because why would I want to be broke? That just, that don't, hold on, hold on. I want to be rich, right? Cause like, you're not depressed with money. And money. Broke but happy? Money. Yeah, broke but happy. Exactly. No, that's why. I'd rather be happy and broke. You know why? Cause, more, most people are like depressed and rich, but what are they doing with their life? They suicidal. They staying in their Hellcat, you know? Exactly. Black the raw wave, you know? But me? Nah. I'm always broke. <laughs> I'm out broke and I'm happy. <laughs> I'd rather be rich and depressed because with that money I could become happy again because think about it you can get the stuff for your family if you think about it you can use that money to help with your family and stuff and look at that you're happy now I would rather be broke and happy I would rather be broke and happy too broke and happy I would rather be rich and, dep and depressed because I'm already depressed what's the difference I'm just got money in my pocket feel me I guess uh, happy and broke because you know I may not have much but at least um, my mental health is at um, like the simple things is what matters most to you yes. in life I'd rather be broke and happy, man. Let's be honest here. Yo, what did I say? Pobre for me. He said poor and happy. Oh. 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 It looks like we had a lot of seaters on either side. Definitely. Did you make the girls wrestling tournament on Sunday? I didn't, but our team did talk to Coach Vaughn about our wrestling teams and their goals. State qualifiers last year of the quad. Let's 
far as girls wrestling is concerned, we were the seventh team in the state. Several girls on our team have beaten or competed with girls that placed in states last year, so I'd like to see I'd like to see our girls go against different competition and, and do well. It looks like everyone on the wrestling teams are having a great time competing. Which leads us to our last segment of the day, trivia. For this week's trivia, we're leaving the bald guys behind and taking a look at some long-haired cedars. But first, let's take some time to congratulate our last trivia winners. Talk it through with your seminar and send Miss Rodriguez your answer. There you have it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on See the News. news.